Ever wonder how dry ice works and why it's called that? We'll find out today, as well as make some things go boom. Stick around. Dry ice was first observed by inventor Adrian Jean Pierre Thelorier. Dry ice is a solid form of carbon dioxide made up of two oxygen atoms and one carbon atom. Its chemical symbol is CO2. It's called dry ice because it changes directly from a solid to a gas. That's called sublimation. When water is added to dry ice, it makes the sublimation process speed up, which creates this heavy fog. Ever been to a Halloween party where there's fog? Probably dry ice. Let's go watch some more rapid sublimation. Ready for some rapid sublimation? I've got some dry ice crushed up in the bottom of this intelligent water bottle. We'll add some water, put the cap back on, and watch what happens. Thanks for watching Random Knowledge. Random knowledge for random people. Have a good day. <clears throat> Dry ice was first observed in 1835 by the inventor. Inventor. I can read that. Too long of a name.